Welcome to Boot Spy. My name's William, and today I'm gonna to be talking about whether or not Red Wing Factory Seconds are actually worth it, even though they're at a discounted price. Are they worth buying? Let's get into it. Guys, thank you so much for joining me. As I said, today we're talking about whether or not Red Wing Factory Seconds are actually worth it. The most reliable place to find Red Wing Factory Seconds is Sierra Trading Post. You can also find them available through Nordstrom Rack, though Nordstrom selection kind of comes in waves. Last time I checked, there weren't any available. There are a few scam sites as well, so if a deal seems too good to be true, it probably is. How bad can a pair of Red Wing Factory Seconds actually be? I wanted to find that out for myself, so I picked up a pair of seconds that are identical to my original Red Wings. So this is my original, these are the factory seconds right here. This is the ultimate Red Wing factory seconds buying guide. I'm gonna show you how a pair of factory seconds compares to the full price boots from Red Wing, direct you to the best place you can find them, and then also alert you to a few of the shady sites that almost tricked me into buying. I almost got scammed. I almost got scammed for the sake of this video too. I just wanted to see for sure, but I didn't. Basically, my biggest concern before buying factory seconds was that I was gonna get like a messed up pair of boots that wasn't even worth the discounted price. Yeah, maybe it's 50% off, but if it doesn't fit, who wants it? I own several pairs of Red Wing boots. I got the Iron Rangers, the Mock Toes, Classic Chelsea's, the Sawmill, and I used to own a pair of Blacksmiths. So I have extensive experience with the brand. They're one of my favorite brands, Red Wing, I love them. And I'm happy to pay full price for a new pair, but Sometimes you see those discounts available for the factory seconds and they can be quite appealing. So what are Red Wing factory seconds? Red Wing factory seconds are boots that have failed to meet the brand's quality standards for one or more reasons. Most factory seconds have defects in the leather that are mostly cosmetic. However, some have faulty construction that may make one boot larger or smaller than the other or some sort of deformity. For the sake of this experiment, I picked up a pair of the Red Wing Classic Mock Toe boots in the Slate Mule Skinner leather. Um, and I also have a pair of the same exact boots, Slate Mule Skinner right here. Um, and this is full price retail, so this is not a Factory Seconds pair right here. From what I can tell, cosmetically, there's very little difference between the Factory Seconds and then the full priced retail Red Wing boots. You're gonna see that one pair is obviously dirtier. That's these ones. These are the full, full price Red Wings I got about a year ago. And the clean boots right here, those are the factory seconds that I just bought for comparison's sake. Obviously something had to be different about the factory seconds. Otherwise, why else would they be factory seconds? So basically what I'm looking at is that on the front left boot, there's a pretty rough grain break right here. Uh, so it looks a lot more like suede almost. It's definitely really, really, it's a tough grain break. It doesn't look like the rest of the boot. Um, it, I'll show some close-up videos, some close-up pictures so you can get a better idea of what that looks like. I also noticed there is a light coloration right here, which again, isn't a big deal, but I can see maybe not um, selling this full price because it does have this scuff right here. Uh, and then lastly, there is a hole punched in the tongue right here. I'm gonna get close-ups of all this stuff, but there is a hole punched in the tongue right here. So there's some leather defects all over this boot, uh, but they're really, really minor in my opinion. And like when you compare it to what this looks like, you know, you're not gonna notice in a couple weeks. Now, my experience doesn't necessarily mean all Red Wing factory seconds are almost the same as retail. I've read some stories about people getting seconds with deformed toe boxes that make the boot uncomfortable or just like unwearable. There's always some risk to buying a pair of factory seconds online. Red Wing, they do this, act, this big warehouse sale where you can see your seconds in person before buying, but that's all the way in Minnesota. And I'm assuming you're shopping all night, so we're gonna kind of stick to that. Each story I've read of somebody getting a, an unwearable pair of factory seconds, I've also seen two or three comments from people who own five, six, seven pairs of factory seconds. They get a great pair every single time. The most common issue with Red Wing factory seconds is a harsh grain break like I have right here. Uh, and some's gonna be, they're gonna be missing a stitch here or there, but ultimately these are issues that kind of fade as you start to break them in and you wear them and they get a little more dirty. Those issues stop being such a big deal. So where should you buy Red Wing factory seconds? The Boots by community, you guys are awesome. And I'm always getting tips from you guys. And the whole, this idea for this video comes from one of you guys sent me an email and said like, hey, what's, you know, do a comparison, what are they like? Uh, so one, I just wanna say I really appreciate you guys being here and when you send me comments, it helps me come up with video ideas and so I really, really appreciate that. Like I said, Sierra Trading Post, they almost always have some factory seconds available. Uh, last time, the first time I checked, they had a bunch of different Iron Rangers. Last time I checked, it was the Chelsea's and, and these. Nordstrom Rack, they also, they're, they're a little more hit and miss and sometimes you can find some on eBay and you can also buy used Red Wings there as well. Red Wing, like I said, they typically host a warehouse sale at their Minnesota headquarters where you can try on factory seconds before buying and then you can check out each pair's specific defects. 
I've never been, but if you're close to the brand's HQ, it could be worth a shot. I bought these through Sierra Trading Post. They have the greatest variety, both for sizes and styles. There aren't a lot of factory seconds at any given time, so you won't always be able to find the style you want. I was hoping to find a pair of Iron Rangers or Blacksmiths, maybe even Beckmans, those are out there sometimes, but none were available when I was shopping. Now, when one of you guys, I, when you mentioned this video idea, we went and looked at Sierra and there were some really cool Iron Rangers in leathers that I've never seen on the retail site. So sometimes there are some really rare uh, Iron Rangers, rare Red Wing boots that are available as factory seconds on Sierra Trading Post. So should you get Red Wing factory seconds? I say if you're looking to get your first pair of Red Wing boots, I wouldn't wait for factory seconds. I just get the pair that you want now uh, because even at full price, you're just you're not going to regret it. Now I got to say I was almost fooled by a site that claims to be a USA outlet version of Red Wing's online store. They seem to have every version of Red Wing boots available in all sizes all for over 50% off. So that seems too good to be true. I was skeptical. I'm going to show you exactly what it looks like because this is a scam site. Folks who've ordered from here, I uh, read this on Reddit. Uh, they either received nothing or they got some cheap like $7 Alibaba sunglasses or like a cheap pair of the boots that are not at all Red Wing. They're, they're like, you know, super fake. So, and they were, they were lucky to get anything. A lot of people ordered from there and their card was just charged, 150 bucks, whatever, and nothing ever came. So definitely beware of the, I think it's like Red Wing Boots Bash USA. That is not a real site. Guys, if you found this video helpful, please give me a thumbs up and also hit that subscribe button down below. I have tons of Red Wing content coming out. I'm gonna have it coming out throughout the rest of the year. So if you wanna hit subscribe, you'll get to see those videos. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Again, thank you so much for submitting ideas for the video. Uh, I think this is a really great idea. So thank you so much. And until next time, put your best boot forward.